Memorial Day weekend just around the corner, which means it is the official start of the Hampton season. We'll have traffic to look forward to, unless you're like our very own Robert Frank, who took a chopper there and is on the beach. Robert, hate to interrupt your beach time, but tell us a little bit more about the costs at play here. Yeah, Sarah, so I left uh, the Wall Street heliport at 8.20. It got here at 9 o'clock, so that's 40 minutes. Now, this is with Uber, which is a, sort of the, the Uber. It's with Blade, which is the Uber of helicopters. And with the Blade app, you just tap it in. It's about $600 for a one-way seat out to the Hamptons, That a drive that normally takes about two and a half to three hours without traffic. Uh, so I raced Kate Rogers, who is still in her Uber. And you can see that map. We're both going about 100 miles. Uh, she's still out on the road. But there are a lot of services now making money from getting people out to the Hamptons. You've got the Jitneys, of course. You've got Long Island Railroad. You've got other helicopter services where you charter the whole chopper. But Blade, in just two years, has already flown 15,000 people in the Northeast. And, you know, look, it's expensive, but I've already been out on the beach an hour, and Kate's probably stuck in traffic. Let's check in with her if she's online. Hey, Robert. Well, I hope you're having fun at the beach. We are still in my beautiful Uber on the way to the Hamptons. We've been in the car for about an hour and 40 minutes. We have just over a half hour left in our trip. Now, we told you earlier about surge pricing. Originally, when we got our quote, it was supposed to be about $200 to $300. We wound up getting an Uber XL so we could fit all of our gear in here. But it was surge pricing, twice the normal fare. So for a seven-seater car, it's going to be between six and $700. But don't worry, our driver, Chen, up here, he is putting the pedal to the metal, so you better save me some of that rosé. We should be with you in just over 40 minutes. Robert, back over to you. You got it, guys. So when, when Kate gets here, we're going to calculate on a dollar-per-minute basis what you spent and what you saved from taking Uber or the Uber of helicopters. So we'll bring that to you as soon as Kate and I are reunited here on the beach. Back over to you guys. Hey, Robert, quick question. Kate says Uber has dynamic pricing. Does Blade have yeah. dynamic pricing as well? In other words, is it 600 bucks and upwards as you get through to peak season? It's, it's, uh, it varies a little bit, but usually no more than 5 or $10. And tomorrow, there are a few seats left, but they're already booked. But, so there's no official surge pricing at Blade. It's pretty much standard one seat, 595 If you're going further out east, it's a little bit more. But there is no surge pricing, per se, at, at Blade.